What's up guys, this is your boy Rusian on another Raid Shadow Legends video and today we really need to talk, okay? So, if you guys know, uh, I have been running two parallel accounts on the Arbiter missions, uh, one of them is pretty much a guide through, the other one is a speedrun. So, how well am I doing on the speedrun? Well, let's see. So, don't take me wrong, I'm not doing bad. Uh, I was doing amazing and that's what really bothers me. So as of right now, I'm just finishing the Minotaur Labyrinth missions. Uh, then I have a couple of more already finished and I will be a little bit stuck on two rank six champions. What shouldn't be a problem, I should be able to get out of there today. But I also have let me see, about 2 days and 20 hours. So, I'm about like 4 days into the account. And I'm already on part 3. Now, what is the problem? What player you need to stop? I, I guess, if you guys play for a while, you already know. Is every time you need a champion for a fusion, he'll not drop. Pretty much by the second day, not even 48 hours, I believe they're about... 46, 46 hours into not gameplay, uh, real time, right? I could have gone to part three, but it took me until this morning. What means it took me almost three days to be able to pull one of the champions that I had left. And that's a huge problem. And it's every time, or oh, even on my uh, low spender account, I had this issue before. When I needed Raider, I swear, Raider would drop all the time until she was the last one. The moment she was the last one for Fusion, and yeah, my fault, I fed her. But if that wasn't Raider, it would be another champion. Okay, plain and simple. In this case was Raider. I probably went through a few hundred Ancient Shards to be able to get Raider. I probably got every single uh, rare about like five to six times. Well, maybe less, there's a lot of rares, but still way too many times and I could not get the one I need for the fusion. So this is a big issue with Plarian and you guys probably think, well, I just had bad luck. Ah, like I said, I'm running two accounts parallel to each other. Uh, it happened to both accounts during the Hell Hades competition. It happened the same way. And I really have about like a dozen accounts where I run some tests, I try to see different things. And there's a lot that I realized that happens all across the accounts around the same time. And I will have, I'm working on something that I'm gonna address some of those issues. Make it a little different, okay? Uh, everybody makes the same type of videos on Raid Shadow Legends. I want to change a bit. But anyway, point is, they gotta stop. Because it stopped being fun. Imagine, in my case, three whole days to be able to get one champion. Just complete the mission. And I get it, player has this thing, they don't want to progress too fast. Why? I mean, if I get to a certain point and I'm moving as fast, like right now, if you guys look at my account, so, I don't have much. I will need it. If I, if I wasn't doing a free-to-play, I would probably be spending money right now to get charged, to try to get some champions. So, you will spend if you have... If you're gonna spend, you're gonna spend. So, there's no real reason. And I get it, and their mindset, it feels like, okay, well, I can't get that rare from the campaign, so... Whoa, let me buy 200 shards and I'm probably gonna get it. You probably won't get it anyway, but yeah, it's... And look, you guys can think it's just me. It's not. Um, it's a complaint I hear from a lot of people, uh, be on forums, be on Reddit, be other creators. That's a huge issue that player really needs to address. I mean, just make random, okay? Just do what you're supposed to do. 1% chance, 5% chance, whatever, for this champion to drop during campaign. 
Keep that. Doesn't matter if that's the last one. That's the last one for a fusion. Doesn't matter. You're lucky you get it. You're not lucky. You don't get it. Now, sure, their mentality is, well, you're going to spend the energy. Yes, if I'm a new player, I'd be screwed, literally. But since I'm not a new player, what I did was I just started leveling um, my food champions because I knew for a fact that I would need to get uh, one of my champions six star uh, for one of the other missions. So that's what I did. But if you don't have experience in the game, you get frustrated because you're forever there. Try to get that one champion and you just won. So player needs to stop that stuff. In the most, there are other games coming up very soon probably. And you don't want a dad to be a rape killer. I love the game. Don't take me wrong, guys. I love Raid Shadow Legends. I love the community. And I think that's why it upsets me so much. Like, you try to do something fun, like a speedrun. And I'm still doing. Because people take at least months to be able to get to the Arbiter. I'm trying to cut my time in, like, half. So I'm, try I'm still trying to see how fast can I go. Uh, I'm pretty much going to get stuck today at some point to get my second six star. So I'm way far, and my keeps are all open. So the moment I get that done... I can sprint through phase three as well. All right, so it's fun. That's what it's supposed to be. That's why uh, I'm producing a couple of other videos, completely different than what I'm doing right now, based on Raid Shadow Legends as well. It should be fun. I mean, you know, that's what we need. Anyway, anywho, that's just a complaint. Uh, also, just to let you guys know, I will be updating you guys where I am on my speed run. You know what I mean? There's no real speed run or raid, but you guys get what I miss, I'm saying. Anywho, level 38, getting to 40 today, hopefully, probably. And, uh, yeah. Anyway, guys, let me know how fast have you got Arbiter. How fast have you got to part 1, 2, 3, and, well, 4 is Arbiter. But, let me know how fast did you complete those parts in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe, and as always... I'll see you in the game.